I am Dr. Panish Alwa. My dear friends, in population wise, the female or male, I think gender wise, I think nowadays we talk no inequality. Though we forget about our inequality, maybe in heart, mind doesn't allow us because we have always been talking a reservation, not only the parliament assembly, in panchayats also that uh, ஏதாவது ஒரு தொழில் இருக்க வேண்டும் படிப்பு இருக்க வேண்டும் அப்படின்லாம் ஒரு நியதிகள் இருந்தது எல்லாம் உடைத்தறியப்பட்டு மைக்ரோ ஃபைனான்ஸ் ஆப்ரேட்டர்ஸ் வில் ஹாவ் டு ஏர்ன் சஃபிஷியன்ட் மணி மேக்சிமைஸ் தர் ப்ராஃபிட் அண்ட் அச்சீவ் தேர் ஐபிஓ அச்சீவ் தேர் அன்லிஸ்டட் கம்பெனி ஷேர்ஸ் அன்லிஸ்டட் கம்பெனி ஷேர்ஸ் அண்ட் செல் தேர் ஷேர்ஸ் இன் த மார்க்கெட் டு இன்வைட் இன்ஸ்டிடியூஷனல் ஃபண்டிங் அஸ் வெல் அஸ் யுவர் இன்டர்நேஷ்னல் ஃபண்டிங் இன் த ஃபார்ம் ஆஃப் ஈக்விட்டி தட் ஹஸ் ஸ்டேட் ஹஸ் கான் அப் So now the today's situation is almost money, not only really government printing notes to increase the purchasing power of downtrodden middle or upper classes, but also the microfinance operators dump money not like based on the capacity or potentials or needing. Just a dump you can take a lakh or 50 half lakh or any amount you can take. you don't uh, you need to save money you don't have to discuss about the issues or problem nothing so that is a state we are living and uh, we are uh, exploiting the back end if they are the front end if women force in the front end they will achieve so many things women entrepreneur will bring a better result than man in every aspect they will allow that not to incur any loss such a capacity they have they'll forecast the forecastings it is a speciality the god has given the women folk but today i we have to appreciate the government of pondicherry have in, has introduced a program it's one of the potential because normally women force has to be directly employed for which there are programs like a funding a finance program by bank or, or maybe non banking financial institutions not to see their activity but to lend their money whether it goes for consumption or whether it goes for luxurious whether they go for conspicuous consumption they never bother about it just they won't get back money or 100% but now woman has learnt only one technique when i borrow the money money i will definitely repay i don't cheat whether it is covid or whether it is a cyclone or tsunami i don't disappoint my microfinance lenders now unless you increase the skill and unless you increase the financial literacy unless you bring them out from the family celebrism the women can force cannot be an independent woman will not be freedom and financial freedom is also not there maybe you got independence from british but i think the women doesn't have independence from the husbands in the indian families so now i have come back to pondicherry government has introduced a direct skill program that is if women is interested to be engaged directly a training capacity will be given in driving auto rickshaw so when she is sleeping or hiring idling at home she can come out to take a training and all the fee everything she doesn't scratch her head the license fee all this kind of the formality things will be done by the government agency and one day a loan will be sanctioned either from the bank or anybody again is a loan i think you know we cannot be escaping again there is a loan given to her or maybe a subsidized loan the very fortunate thing is it's not like a petroleum maybe like a e vehicle so that way i think one way they don't have to spend more money for fuel another way that it reduces the pollution in the economy in the country physically that way i think we are very much thankful that the woman has uh, stepped into to learn this uh, driving uh, uh, learning and again they uh, again tend to go for it probably they should go for it to uh, have owning a vehicle the community should allow and uh, your family should allow 
and i had a bitter experience with the transgenders when they drove uh, two or three vehicles it was appreciated later it was criticized okay let us come back so now when a vehicle is given a driving system there is a confidentiality and again there is a in her mind to earn money on her own number one number two that is there is a confidence level number three in the society in the community people will recognize them and moreover especially for the women i think you know atrocity we know that whether it is women or child abuses those people will be sheltered with the women folk women folk to some to a greater extent they don't go for uh, uh, adulterating or uh, this kind of abuses or uh, adultery punishments or something like that they do not happen because they have their own uh, logic of uh, their own sense of consciousness so uh, since it is there probably this will give you a very good result we should appreciate and other states could also replicate to support or safeguard the economic and financial freedom of the women folk to lead a dominant or essential role and again indispensable role in the family she can be given this kind of opportunities not like dumping money on her head because when money is dumped she is also going to utilize the money either for the family or maybe their children education other very productive purposes but even though they are called as a social capital or productive purposes it won't be a like a income creating income generating activities because the amount is spent for education health will be saved will be spent or by their generation not by herself and there should not be a problem on her to find a way to repay the money now we, we were talking about removal of rural indebtedness urban indebtedness so much of things so now we cannot talk on this subject because indebtedness is becomes a universal everywhere i think in a family you knock the door minimum they will have two or three cards whether it is from the bank or for the microfinance or self help groups or anywhere there is a borrowed money in the house so now to come out of it only alternative is to make them to be engaged in activity where the income is generated created that will really support that will help them to function their financial literacy properly so that whatever the borrowal can be repaid out of her income rather borrowing borrowing or multiple borrowing we do agree they have come out from money lender but uh, today there was a money lender now there are lenders maybe you cannot call them as a, the similar money lenders of exorbitant interest but still the professional money lenders really exhaust exploit our women folk so women folk should be given opportunity like a, the skill based program or a skills directly sell the skills make them to be engaged in a program through which i think she can be sustainable in the family she should be sustainable when she is sustainable the rest of them will also get is sustainable so we should be thankful to the efforts taken by this territory and a similar kind of skills will have to be put on her head to bring her up to the society very well then only i think uh, what all we have been talking the celebration reservations and uh, the mannerism in um, creating giving a recognition will all be uh, whether respected or uh, could be called as a myth and uh, that could be also be equal to other gender so we'll let wait a good day to come thanks for listening